<clears throat> Where's the thing I was going to read? Hi, Lotus. Welcome to Prelude to Ulysses, where we ask the important questions. Like, huh? And what? Huh? Uh, this is a good one. That's not what we're reading. Today on Alex Reads Littler Things, we're going to read a short story by Franz Kafka. Excursion into the Mountains by Kafka. Um, I started doing this before I start the show. And honestly, I think that looks pretty good. Also, having a nice marker helps. Also, um, washing the board correctly helps as well. I'm sure that was important information to include. Without further ado, <clears throat> or be do, we're going to stop before C do. <laughs> Excursion into the mountains. I don't know, I cried without being heard. I do not know if nobody comes. Then nobody comes. I've done nobody any harm. Nobody's done me any harm. But nobody will help me. A pack of nobodies, yet that isn't all true. Only that nobody helps me, a pack of nobodies would be rather fine. On the other hand, I'd love to go on excursion, on an excursion. Why not with a pack of nobodies? Into the mountains, of course, where else? How these nobodies jostle each other, all these lifted arms linked together, these numberless feet treading so close. Of course, they are all in dress suits. We go so gaily. The wind blows through us, and the gaps in our company. Our throats swell and are free in the mountains. It's a wonder that we don't burst into song. All right, I'm starting to feel Kafka a little more. Starting to, <clears throat> I'm unfamiliar with this guy at all. I've never read Metamorphosis or any of the, nothing, else. I don't know. That's the only thing I know of him besides a few things I did read that I liked a lot. Um, so this is just kind of, seems like an inner monologue that he's actually screaming. I'm assuming this person's inside. I'm assuming this person doesn't have friends. I'm assuming this person is all by themselves. I do not know. I do not know if nobody comes, then nobody comes. I've done nobody any harm. Nobody's done me any harm. Nobody will help me. But then he says, a pack of nobodies. Yet that isn't true, only that nobody helps me. A pack of nobodies would be rather fine, on the other hand. Um, this is just, I think, I think this, uh, <clears throat> indicates just a flip, a flip in your brain. This is when one thought transforms into another. This is, uh, when your thought process is not in control of itself. It's thinking about how, how alone he is and how maybe it'd be nice to have people with him. It's like kind of hateful at first. And he's like, that's eh, not really true. Um, it'd be really nice to have people. We could like hold hands and sing and go into the mountains. Hmm. This is a, this excursion into the mountains is a transition, a mental transition to me of hmm. what's the word? Being isolated or and not not taking responsibility for I don't know feeling ostracized and then feeling lonely wishing that he had people but like kind of like blaming them at first I wonder if I explained this well I don't know 
Kafka's catching pieces. Um, and I think the point is maybe I don't agree with the voice, the voice of Kafka. Awesome. It's good to not agree with things sometimes. I don't know. Well, I do agree. I mean, we've all felt this. Or I have, for sure. Where you're like, oh, fuck everybody. And then you're like, ah, oh, God, I wish I had someone to go see a movie with or something. That's not the people. I don't know. That was fun, wasn't it? Did we get too introspective? Did you? All right. Join us next time on... I thought I turned it off. Now I'm here talking anyways. All right. Well, let's go ahead and play a little music. See if we can change the atmosphere. that up a little bit let's start off good though and ended bad i think we can all relate to that chick 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 chick